It's a featherweight matchup between Cub Swanson and Hot Grand Barnaby Diaz. Hot Grand Diaz makes his way out of the tunnel and he looks ready to go. This guy has nasty chokes. His ability to cinch up a choke and finish it from any position is truly elite. elite fighters in the world in the UFC's featherweight division. His ability to cover distance and his accuracy as well as the unpredictable nature of his attacks make him amongst the elite of the featherweights in the UFC. Our tail of the day for this featherweight fight. This is a very even matchup. Everything between these two fighters is virtually identical. Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds of the UFC featherweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, a jiu-jitsu fighter, holding a professional record of 23 wins, three losses, and one draw. He stands five feet eight inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Rio de Janeiro, Brazil, Hakuna! Jiu-Jitsu fighter, holding professional record of 21 wins, 7 losses. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Palm Springs, California, Tom Swanson! And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Mergliata. Dan Mergliata, our referee. Ready. Ready. And here we go. Fight scheduled for three five-minute rounds. <laughs> Cub Swanson trains at Greg Jackson's camp, and he is an animal on the ground. He's a black belt in Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu and does extremely well when competing in pure grappling competitions. He's extremely crafty on the mat and can end this fight quickly if he spots an opening. He's doing some damage with those elbows here in the clinch. And from here, transitions to the Muay Thai clinch. Powerful strikes. Big left hand. Oh, he missed that kick. Man, he goes down. Swanson with the one two that scores. Excellent job of landing punches here. Joe really starting to see some damage done due to those body strikes. Absolutely, Mike. Good straight to the body by Swanson. And he's looking for that left. And he scores a single leg takedown. And they 
shot. Rubber guard. Now he's back into full guard. He passes again into half guard. Throws a hammer at him. And back up again. Swanson gets caught by the right kick. You can hear Greg Jackson. Oh, oh he's hurt. Hurt. That one got him. This could be it right here. Straight punch. Flying knee. Big overhand. There he is. Got the takedown. Oh, he's good left hand. Big hammer fist. Transitions to full guard. Takes the guillotine. He's out of the guillotine. Passes into half guard. Oh, that's an outstanding transition. Take a look at some of the action from that round. There's a nice knee to the head. And here's another knee to the head. And there's one more knee that lands to the head. And there she is, the lovely Brittany. Here we go. Now, starting off this round, you've got to think that the barrage that he endured in that last round is still affecting him. He's going to want to start this round off and move and avoid taking any damage. Now, made a good, oh, good elbow. elbow. Very nice. Man, he's really doing some damage with those knees. He's in a better position here with the tie clinch. He scores with the knee. Tying up here in the clinch. Looking to try to get some sort of an advantage. Brutal knee. Exchanging knees here in the clinch. Another big knee lands. Oh, man. Those are nasty knees. Oh, that's a vicious knee to the body. He does have full guard here, which is still dangerous. Moves into full mount. Awesome control from the top. Hip escape. And he's out of the full mount. Nicely done. Now he's in full guard. Midway point of the fight. Nice sweep. Now he's in half guard. Just over two remain. Nice sweep to get to top position. Joe, he's showcasing some great movement on the ground. Half guard. Back to side control. Now he goes north-south. Under a minute remains in the second round. Good shot to the body. Diaz gets it back to side control. 
Joe, you can see the effects of those body shots. There's a ton of bruising on his right side. Let's move back into side control once more. Caught him with a right hand. Nicely done. And the end of the round. Good job, guys. And here's a nice shot, lands perfectly. And here's another clean shot that lands. And another perfectly placed strike. The lovely Ariani here tonight in Las Vegas, Nevada. remain <laughs> nicely done great job blocking that punch good left hand by Diaz Joe he's really on point with his strikes tonight man his face is a mess huge wow, left, that's a hand. Big left hand Connects with the left. Oh, big shots. Hector. Oh. What an exchange. Oh, that one hurt him. Flying knee. Oh. Head kick. Oh, beautiful hook. Oh, very nice. Oh, that's a vicious kick. Huge kicks. Left hand. Boom! Oh. This could be Trying it. To finish it right here. Nice. Big oh. right hand. Superman punch. Caught by another elbow. Powerful takedown by Diaz. He's got the back. This is where he's outstanding. Excellent posture here. Wow, quick movement on the ground. Big oh, left that hand. That was a hard one, Mike. Oh! He works his way into north south. Great movement on the ground. Gets his back one more time. He's back to side control. Nice transitions. There he goes, back Joe. To mount again. That's swelling on him. He's trying to isolate that arm here. He's got the arm here. Now he's going to throw his leg over. He's free from the arm bar. Half guard. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. He's posturing up here. This he scores with a huge left. This what one goes the distance. What an outstanding back and forth fight. Joe, let's take a look at the fight replay. Round one, look at the technique here in this amazing flying knee. Round two, perfect timing and technique and a beautiful takedown completed. Round three, this is the shot that clearly stuns her right there. We have our official decision, and here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. The judges score the contest 30-27, 9-28.
29-28, with a winner by unanimous decision, Hakron Diaz! Hakron Diaz earns the victory by unanimous decision.